Jake is not here, so we move forward. We're blessed to have in our list uh, Deputy uh, Director for the Ministry for Tourism, Arts and Culture. And on behalf of the Minister. Wakanda forever. Wakanda forever. Wakanda forever. Wakanda forever. Wakanda forever. Good friend and good friend. Good to see you. Distinguished invited guest, brother Rabbi, the press, ladies and gentlemen. I must say that I'm deeply honored and privileged to join you as we remember of a great athlete. Mr. Dixon, as I listen to you, I was moved by uh, the connectivity between the motherland and the past. And there is a future to this one. Young, beautiful, gifted, talented citizens of the United States and all across the diaspora come back home to find peace, to help the world to address this problem. Just like you, I attended the Historical Black College, and I might have gone to a power after getting my master's, my MA at Clark Atlanta. Mm -hmm. I wanted so bad to go to Howard to do a PhD, mm -hmm. uh, but Clark Atlanta would not let me go. They wanted to have me, so I had to stay behind and do my PhD. But I can relate to the Howard experience. I can relate to the bond that unites us. I felt so much at home when I first went to Clark Atlanta. The environment and everything reminded me of my home country garden. And I stuck there to talk as a student, a researcher, and a lecturer. And so I can relate to the experiences of Howard and what Chadwick, our brother, went through. And I'm so honored and privileged that this day I have been asked by my honorable minister to come and represent uh, and read the statement that uh, the people of Ghana, on behalf of the government of people of Ghana, as we memorialize and remember this great Africa. And so it is with emotions mixed with the pain of death and the splendor of a world lived life. But I stand before you to pay homage to the late Chadwick Aaron Boltzmann. The man Chadwick Boltzmann that we eulogize today lived a very fulfilled and wholesome life on this planet Earth. He exhibited great talent and was endowed with an unadulterated charisma which captivated his audience and fascinated his admirers all over the world. Mr. Bozeman was a true embodiment of the African spirit. Many of the major human achievements in science and technology, education, sports, athletics, health, creative arts, and many other fields were built through the hard work of people of African-American descent. Chadwick was your constitutional African American who embodied and continued this tradition with such finesse and essence. He starred in many movies, but to many of us on the African continent, Chadwick came to us as T'Challa, the Prince of Wakanda, in the Black Panther superhero movie. The Black Panther movie even though fictional, brought an exhilarating and empowering narrative of Africa. The Black Panther movie, through Prince T'Challa, brought together pieces of the African story, bringing to life some perspective from the nationalist Black Panther movement of the 1960s. It highlighted Africa's unique culture and aesthetic as seen in the makeup and costume of the movie, and portrayed Africa's rich 
natural resources and Africa's diplomacy and international affairs. Denzel Hayes Washington Jr., one of my favorite artists, who was instrumental in mentoring Chadwick, had this to say of him. And I quote, he was a gentle soul and a brilliant artist who will stay with us for eternity through his iconic performances over his short yet illustrious career. End of quote. Chadwick's life on earth was extraordinarily watered by his gentleness of soul and brilliance both on set and in real life. Through his work, he managed to light a touch for people of African descent, for Africa, the ancestral home, and for the African-American struggle. Chadwick Aaron Bosman, your untimely departure from this world is an unfortunate mix of sadness and pain, especially for your close family and friends who knew you best. Your departure to glory has brought a reawakening of the collective African consciousness and togetherness. Your life here on earth, as short as it was, keeps stoking the embers of the flame you lit. This flame we will hold and keep alive in our hearts for generations yet unborn. Till we meet again, King T'Challa, rest in peace, Chadwick, rest in power, Chadwick, Katete, Daye, Damerafa. Wakanda forever. Wakanda forever. Wakanda forever.